we are going to learn how to use Teams files offline. Teams has two parts. Files can be in chat, which are basically OneDrive files. And then there are Teams channel files. OneDrive files get synced automatically. Even if someone shared the file with you, you can still go to OneDrive, shared, shared with me, and you will be able to see the file. Files shared with you cannot be synchronized. But what about channel files? Teams channel files are on SharePoint, but they do not get synchronized with the desktop automatically. So let's see how to synchronize those files. Now you can't do this for all the teams. You'll have to do it one team at a time. So go to the team, then go to the general channel. In a channel, you have multiple tabs. Go to files tab. You will see documents slash general. And then you will see a sync button. Do not click on that button. First click on the documents part and then use the sync button. It will show you a pop up asking you do you want to sync? Yes. Let it do its job. Files from all the channels in that team will be synchronized with your desktop. Now where exactly it is? Go to file explorer. Usually you will see OneDrive hyphen company name. Those are OneDrive files. Then you should see another similar folder with just the organization name. That is the place where Teams and SharePoint files synchronize. In that folder, the team name will be mentioned. And when you go inside, you will see all the channels, which are basically folders. Now, which icon do you see next to all those files and folders? Cloud icon. So all these are cloud files. Double click, open, then it becomes a green tick mark. That means it's occupying space locally. So only the files which you are working on are occupying space locally. You can also prepare for your offline editing while you're online. For example, I'm about to embark on a long aircraft flight with no internet, but I know which files I need to edit. So while I have the internet connection, go to those files and folders, select them, right click on them and say, always keep on this device. So while you have the internet, those will be downloaded and then you can work while you're offline. So that's how you sync Teams files with your desktop. That's it for now. Thank you.